if you are a jira admin then many times you will get this kind of request so uh, very very uh, useful like uh, i want to disable some users which is those users are not active in last uh, uh, six month last uh, 90 days etc so how to disable those user because your license is used by those users right and uh, you don't want to um, give the license for inactive user which are not going to use so if you are going to user admin uh, user management and you are checking all the active users or all not active users see so like this i am using the 13 users in all of if you are you are part of big mncs and also there you can find of some 40000 users or 50000 users and you want to disable it's a very difficult part so with the help of this manage inactive user uh, we can uh, see it we can uh, use this one and uh, with the help of this plugin we can achieve our things okay so i don't i want to disable this user because it's not active in last five to six days i want to deactivate this user i want to remove jira user group okay copy this one he is part of jira internal directory as you can see user directory it's a jira internal i'm selecting if you are using ad and there are another group then you can select you want to proceed any group if yes then click on it I want to remove that group I have selected okay come down you want to add some group if those are uh, users are active then you can select click on update on demand run run inactive user click on run this group called removed come here click on filter see in one shot I have done now I want to remove this group as well multiple groups then you can select uh, multiple groups come here comma separator control v click on update on demand run so it's a cron job then it will run automatically in some specific time see both groups got removed so he's a not part of application he doesn't have the license now we have removed okay now come here I want to activate the user okay so how to activate the user now remove all these things click here click on update on demand run run okay so it's sorry it's for an inactive user so it's not going to work if uh, you want former user and you want to add any user group like this then you can select it over here and you can activate okay former user those were the former user right from the internal directory I want to add this group click on update on demand run dry run click on run so it's going to remove those users so it's done okay so for adding one we can check it out um, let's see okay rename rename this user this is for uh, okay activate uh, this is the schedule which is going to update in you know, one specific time come down if you want to see the report you can see the report as well come here if you want to see the custom remote user directory then uh, you can use if you are using any other directory uh, octa or g suite etc then you can select it so thank you for watching like this you can do that